It was precisely one year ago today that this CCTV recorded Nellie Herriot on the 1A bus. She travelled from the centre of Brighton to the Whitehawk estate, but there she disappeared. Her family are still without answers. And the closed circuit TV footage showed that she was wandering around with one lens missing in her glasses and the weather on that day was extremely wet and windy and she was seen getting off a bus in an area that she wouldn't normally visit routinely. So those circumstances are rather erratic, rather concerning for us. Nellie lived alone in Bonchurch Road but got off the bus a mile away from her home. She suffers from Alzheimer's and is very deaf, so one suggestion is she got on the wrong bus and was confused when she arrived at Whitehawk. But no one's seen her since, and there are few clues. Although we're not actively investigating her disappearance at the moment, and the case isn't closed, and we're very much um, we would still be looking for anyone to come forward with information, and we would look into any new um, sightings that, that we were told about. Well, those who were closest to her, myself, my mother, and my sister, um, we have had to come to terms with the situation. Um, we feel very wretched because we haven't got a conclusion one way or the other, and uh, we can't even remember her properly, which is, which is very distressing indeed. In the days after Nellie vanished, there were more than 100 potential sightings, but none came to anything. Her family hoped this anniversary appeal might finally lead to a conclusion. David Johns, ITV News.